everyone, so today is Vlogmas Day 5 and I'm going to be baking gingerbread cookies. Uh, a lot more work goes into it than I originally thought and I'm not very good at baking so we'll see how this goes, but hope you enjoy. I have all my ingredients laid out here and uh, the recipe is just on my phone so I'm just going to get right into it. So first we get five and a half cups of flour. So that looks like a ton and I'm uh, kind of worried now. Mix in baking soda and salt. So it's one teaspoon of baking soda. And one and a half teaspoons of salt. So I'm just going to use uh, ground cinnamon and ground ginger. Four teaspoons of ground cinnamon. And four teaspoons of ground ginger. And then mix butter and sugar. <laughs> so it's one cup of brown sugar. Which I'm just gonna use in this. I don't have two mixing bowls, so I'm just gonna use Tupperware. 16 tablespoons of butter, which seems like a lot and it's kind of disgusting if you really think about it. Then add two eggs. And mix after each egg is added. And then add in the other egg. Then add one and a half cups of molasses. Now the mixture should look like this. Slowly add in your dry mixture. And then you're supposed to divide the dough into three portions and refrigerate for one hour. So there's one, two, and three. So now you just have these three that you're going to put in the fridge for one hour. So we will see you guys in an hour. So you take it out of the freezer and just roll it all out, put it on parchment paper that is lightly floured, and then you're going to put it in the freezer for 15 minutes. Take it out of the freezer and get your cookie cutters, whatever shape you want, and just cut out the dough into different shapes. When, once you are finished that, you're going to put it on some parchment paper without flour this time to get it ready to put in the oven. And then you're just going to take the remaining dough and roll it up and roll it out until you get as many cookies out of it as possible. And then after you are done this, you're going to put them in the freezer for another 15 minutes when they're cut out and then you're ready to put them in the oven. So 
So cookies are almost done. Um, they only go in for about six minutes at 350 degrees and then you take them out after six mi minutes and uh, hit the pan on the counter so that the cookies flatten and then you put them in for another six minutes or until they look a little bit more brown. I'll just show you what they look like. And they look super good. They're just about finished. So this is the end product. There is about 40 cookies, which is a crazy amount. Didn't think it was going to make this many, but it turned out pretty good. Some of them are burnt, but most of them are okay. Uh, all in all, this took about four hours, three or four hours. So unless you're willing to spend that amount of time baking, do not try this recipe. I will be doing another recipe next week on Monday. So every single Monday I'll be doing a new uh, baking recipe. So if you guys want to see that, remember to subscribe. And this is the end of Vlogmas Day 5.